50 metres from the start. All make a good line and they're off. So from out wide on the track, from barrier five, coming across is Don't Tell Errol, and Don't Tell Errol's going to take up the lead. Punner's Delight's going to come across and sit on its back. Out wider on the track from barrier four is Bertie Francis, then back on the inside is Hawley Could. Card Nash is one out, one back in the running line, and then last on the inside is Green and Gold. So as they come into the straight, and Don't Tell Errol is leading, although Bertie Francis is up outside, taking it on, back on the inside. Third on the inside is Punner's Delight, and 1-1 one, one is Carter Nash. Three back on the inside is Hawley Could, and Green and Gold's been driven quietly. So as they come into the straight, and Bertie Francis is going to go on and take up the lead. It's leading out by about six metres to Don't Tell Errol. Three back on the inside is Punner's Delight, and facing the breeze is Carter Nash. On its back is... Green and gold, and last on the inside is Hawley Could. So as they go into the back with about 900 metres to go, and Bertie Francis, after a little bit of works, travelling well from Don't Tell Errol. Punner's Delight looks to be travelling well, three back the inside, and Carden Nash is going to do it tough for the entire journey. Back on the inside, four back on the inside is Hawley Could, and green and gold on Amanda Turville is being driven quietly at this stage. So as they go out the back, and looks like Bertie Francis is up the tempo a little bit, sledding out by about seven metres to Don't Tell Errol, who's under a little bit of pressure to keep up. Punner's Delight looks to be travelling well and is going to pop off, I'd say, soon. Then Card Nash is whacking away okay. Hawley Could on the inside, and green and gold still being driven quietly in last position. So as they go past the 400, and Bertie Francis is leading, Don't Tell Errol... Punner's Delight makes it move from three back the inside and is coming out. And then on its back is Hawley Could. A good gap there to Green and Gold, who's just passing Card Nash. So as they come into the top of the straight, and Bertie Francis under a little bit of pressure, although they're tra travelling well. He's leading by about five metres from Don't Tell Errol, who's kicking back okay. But Bertie Francis down the line looks like she's going to hold on. So Bertie Francis holds on to beats Don't Tell Errol. I think third position maybe Hawley could just on the line from Punner's Delight. Then came Card Nash and Green and Gold was given a very quiet trial in last position. Errol, he's a seven-year-old gelding by Flight Path out of West Ringia. West Ringia sorry.